Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel. As most of you know, I'm Topher. And for those of you who don't know and just randomly decided to click on my video, welcome to the channel. I'm Topher. Thank you for stopping by. So we're here to do a reaction. It has been something that's been sitting in my React playlist for a for quite some time and I'm super excited about it and I have to discover it on my own. You guys are holding out on me. Um, ever since I reacted to Marcelito Pomoy on um, the X Factor Champions, people have been requesting like right and left for me to do more Marcelito reactions. And I wanted to, I want to do more reactions, but he's done so many on the X Factor. And ever since I got that copyright strike um, from KZ's performance on The Singer, I said that I wasn't going to be reacting to any more singing competition shows because it's just, it's been so difficult for me to upload videos and not have them either immediately copyright infringement emails coming to me or to get the copyright charge. And I'm like, I, I just, I, I don't want to deal with that. Um, but there was a duet that he did with Morris and Amon on the Wish Bus, and the Wish Bus seems to be good with me, so we're going to go, or it wasn't on the Wish Bus, it was the Wish 107.5 Awards, and they're singing Secret Love Song. I've watched Morissette sing this at least twice, if not more times than that. And like I've said, Little Nix is made for Morissette to cover because she just does so well with her music and I don't know how Marcelito is going to fit into this but I'm sure he's going to fit in beautifully and without further ado we're just going to dive into it and see what he has in store see what they both have in store Wish 107.5 This feels more like the upbeat version that they did with Jason and Leo. Why can't you hold me in the street? Why can't I kiss you on the dance I wish that it could be like that. Like okay! You better stop it, Marcelino! Cause I'm yours, I'm yours. Oh, 
getting that little growl in there. Y'all better work. Y'all better work. Goodness. Like, it is just... Like, obviously, from the reaction I did with Marcelino, I know that he can do the super high-pitched voice and then do the super manly tenor voice as well. So I know that's there, but it still caught me by surprise when he came out with it. I was just like, I was... I should have expected, but I wasn't expecting it. And, like... It just snuck in there because like it sounded so perfect it sounded so much like a female singer like I until about three seconds into him singing I thought it was still more set continuing the verse and then I noticed that it wasn't quite her voice and then I saw his shadow come through and I'm like you better work you better work like sometimes I wish that I had that kind of because he's still like i said he can sing up there and sound like a female and then he can still embrace his manly tenor and sound like a full-on opera singer or man and like sometimes i wish i had that quality to my voice where i could embrace that and sound you know more feminine especially like when i'm in drag performing in drag because i prefer to sing live when i'm in drag and it kind of gives away the illusion when you know i'm a pretty looking woman and this bassy man starts singing at you like i just don't have that type of voice no matter how high in my range or how soft and delicate i make it it's still a, a baritone i'm still a man that's what it is but his his ability to just flip between them so flawlessly i'm like damn you can make so much money if you were a drag right now lord you, you would sell that illusion let me tell you but god he, he's so good and morris like i said at the top little mix was made for Morissette to cover because Morissette lives in this genre of music. She lives in their vocal arrangement. She lives in like it just it just suits her voice so well. All and like when I reacted to her singing this song, like I had mentioned that I wasn't a huge fan of the upbeat version that they did with Jason Derulo. This version I prefer the slower ballad version just because I feel like it interprets the lyrics better it touches it, it just hits it strikes a chord with me better where like the upbeat version it just kind of takes away from that and then there's lyric changes and Jason Derulo like it just it gives you a whole different feel and takes away from the lyrics a little bit for me but I actually didn't mind it so much here um, I still prefer the ballad version and honestly I wish they would have just sang the ballad version and done that as a duet but it's an award show, I get it. We, we don't, we're, we're trying to get people hype and moving and whatnot, so we'll do the things that be and whatnot. But it was, it was still fantastic. Morissette did so many subtle things, which I've, I've heard her do before, but it's just, it's so, I haven't listened to her in a long time, aside from the reaction that I did earlier in the week. And like, it's just so refreshing to hear, to hear her. Like, it's just, and she didn't even go super low in this performance, but like, some of the, just some of the uh, her vocal onsets when she was s starting her phrases down here, where it wasn't it wasn't necessarily soft and heady. It was like kind of soft and chesty, like the. Except whatever how she does it, like there's just so many 
little things that she did that were so beautiful. And then, of course, her belting is everything. Her squeaks, oh, I haven't heard those in a hot minute. Yes, God, praise Jesus. And then, you know, her growls, like, she, she's just so good. He's so good. And they did fantastic together. I would love to hear them sing a ballad together, one where it doesn't require, you know, so much of, like, entertaining the audience and, you know, using all this energy where it's more just we stand here, we sing, and we deliver amazing, amazing things. I would love to hear them sing a ballad together because ballads are my jam. Um, so if they have a performance like that, well, let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, turn on notifications so you'll be notified when all my shenanigans get posted. If there's anything else you'd like me to react to, be sure to leave it down in the comments or send it to me on my various social media, and I'll get to it as soon as I possibly can. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Love ya. Hey guys, don't forget to check out the playlist on my channel for all of your favorite reaction videos. We've got playlists for Morissette Amon, Kelly Clarkson, Katrina Velarde, Tori Kelly, and more, so be sure to check them out.